Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time you are watching this video. If you are new around here, welcome. We are converting this 11 seater transit minibus into a camper van. And on today's episode, we are going to be tiling the kitchen area. It's going to be another first for me, so we'll see how we get on. I did, as you can see, order up a shed load of sample tiles because I didn't want to go with a white backboard because all of this cladding is going to be painted white as well. However, we have got white tiles. <laughs> so end up going for white. However, we are going to have a black grout and a black trim as well. So hopefully it won't look all washed out with white if that makes any sense so yeah we're gonna give that a go gonna tile for the first time in my life we'll see how it goes it's all set out and um, my mate came around last weekend and actually helped me a little bit with setting it out but first things first we are going to be framing the window just because i'm going to be tiling up to the window frame so we're gonna do another couple nice mitre joints round the edges can't get this finger pointing thing right yeah so we're going to be doing mitre joints and then we're hopefully i'm going to probably put some up there as well and then um yeah so first things first we are going to be getting the frame for the window done and then we're going to crack on with the tiling so without further ado let's get into this episode So the frame is done, it's not looking too bad, I'm going to be painting this frame walnut, same as the roof, so hopefully with the white it will contrast nicely. But now we're going to start with the tiling, we've got some Ditra mat, I'm going to PVA that to the wall just to help the tiles give out a little bit more flexibility for when we're driving. So we're going to stick that on and then start tiling, let's go. mat is on I've just put a couple of bits of batten on just to secure the edges whilst we wait for it to dry and then once it's dry we're gonna take the batten off and start tiling so this is quite exciting also um, to with the tiling I've got these self can't really see self leveling tiling spacers I'm gonna be doing the uh, uh, the grout line at three mil. Let me just put you up there. So basically what you do is, so you say the wall's there, you put the spacer behind it, and then that space is three mil thick, and then you just lock it in with obviously, let me grab another tile. Obviously you lock it in like that. So you have that three mil route line that we're going to achieve pretty cool I'll, I'll put the uh link to the leveling spacer kit down below if anyone's interested it got it from amazon so yeah we'll see how we get on with that so no i can't take them out now yeah but yeah we're gonna wait for the we're gonna wait for the uh ditra mat to dry the pva 
and then once that's dry we are going to be cracking on with the tiling we've got some uh ready mixed shower proof tile adhesive just to make it a little bit easier now let's start grouting up i have a i don't really know what's give it a go i guess <laughs> Okay, so I'm actually at uh, adhesive. I've just ordered some up. I'm gonna go quickly and grab some. Hopefully this doesn't dry in the meantime. It should be okay. But we've got two rows done, which I'm actually very impressed with. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna quickly go grab the grab that adhesive and then we're gonna be right back at it. So be right back. Okay, so this side of the wall is done. Just got this bit to go, but I'm absolutely over the moon of how it's going and how it looks so far. Considering I've never done tiling in my life, I'm really happy with the outcome so far. I think this is the most pleased I've been on this project so far, I think. Um, so yeah, it's I, I'm 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 just insanely happy. So we've got this wall left to do. Um, what the plan is, I'm going to plan on finishing tiling this side today, and then in the morning we are we're going to give the chance for the adhesive to set off, and then in the morning we are going to grout it up. But I'm happy. I'm so happy with it. Yeah, I'm really happy. Did I tell you I'm really happy over it? <laughs> Okay, we have tiled the wall. Trim is a little bit, it's not great, but it is what it is. For my first ever attempt at tiling, I would say great success. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna pack up today's, today, today, today. Um, it's like half seven, eight o'clock now. Um, let the adhesive go off and set and then we'll be back in the morning to grout up and then hopefully finish a couple of other things as well so see you in the morning which is the same episode you should know the drill by now but yeah i will see you in the morning good morning little tile update taking all the wedges out but the adhesive still hasn't quite set off yet so 
some parts are still a little bit wobbly um, making me doubt it all now but we will see we'll give it a few more hours before we try and grout and whatever but for now we have the correct fill valve for the tank that we installed last episode so we're gonna complete the gas installation we're gonna attach the fill valve and then yeah, we're going to install the fill valve and then attach it to the tank. So this is what we're going to do first thing. We're just going to make up the valves, going to wrap some gas PTFE around the threads just to seal them, make sure there's no leaks. We've already tested the rest of the system and there's no leaks on that, so that's all good. Two, three. Don't need to do many wraps, four or five. And this is the valve. That on the valve, the nut. Right, that is on. And I think we're going to drill some holes in that plate. But we've got the other one we need to put on the actual tank itself. Finished off the gas tank, connected up the inlet fill valve to the actual tank. I've just sprayed it black as well with a Plasti Dip just to give it a little bit more protection against chips and things like that. Um, I don't think we are going to be grouting today because I messed up a little bit. Um, a few tiles hadn't exactly set and a couple end I ended up pulling a few off so I re, uh, re Adhesive. I redone them, reapplied adhesive. So, as you can see, waiting for them to set off. Um, I'll probably do that one evening after work. Um, I'm hoping that it works because I got a little bit annoyed with the fact that I didn't read the instructions properly. But um, we will continue with the tiling. It will just have to be tomorrow after work maybe but we'll see we'll see um just doing a couple little things that i've been putting off now the gas tank's done i've spread i've just sprayed it you give it another half hour before another coat and then another half hour before another coat and then another half hour before another coat i ideally want like three or four coats on it um but yeah i mean we're gonna have days like this still productive still making progress but uh yeah Good morning, good afternoon, whatever time it is. <sighs> Haven't actually been on the van for a week or so because I've been away. Um, <clears throat> and I wanted to let the adhesive set off. I did run into a few problems. I didn't apply enough adhesive to some of the tiles. So I had to reapply the adhesive. And then I wanted to give it a good while to set off before we start grouting. Um, unfortunately, I have chipped one of the tiles pretty badly, but I'll repair it. I'll repair it. But now the adhesive's uh, set off, we are finally going to be grouting it up. I'm going to use a black grout. Hopefully, it will look good. <laughs> um, it's not the best tiling, I'll admit, but it is my first ever time tiling, and taking that into consideration, I'm pretty proud of it. So... Let's start grouting it up. Right. <laughs> oh my God. Right, let's see how this goes. Oh my God. Ugh. Nobody told me it would be this messy.
tiles are grouted and I am so pleased with them. I think, um, like I said, first time tiling, it's not going to be perfect, but I just get so wound up with myself because I want it to be perfect, but I know that's not going to be reality. Um, I've taken off the cladding just to clean up the trims a little bit and taken off this frame. Um, I think I've got enough wood to redo the frame, so I'm going to do that now. Um, and then with the cladding, I need to get more cladding anyway to finish this side off. So we're just going to redo this side because it's all black and covered in grout and shit, which we don't want. Um, but yeah, it's it's looking all right, I think. I did chip one tile, which is annoying me. Um, so we're going to have to try and hide that somehow. But... Um, all in all, I'm pretty, pretty pleased with it, I think. It's looking pretty good. I've redone the frame, as you can see, make it look a little bit neater. Um, and I've just had a tidy up of the van a little bit. Um, but yeah, wow, okay, we've done the tiling, which, as I said, I've never tiled before, all things considered. I'm quite proud of it. A little bit annoyed I did chip a couple of tiles trying to get the adhesive out of the grout, but we've done it. We have tiled the kitchen area, so that means we can now get the basin on and the two ring burner, but I don't think we're going to do that yet. Um, a little bit unsure as to what to do next. I might take a couple of weeks off or a week off or something just to plan and things like that oh out of frame yeah just to plan and things like that I, d I don't know i don't know we'll see we're um we're gonna wing it at this point because <laughs> that's what we do best um but yeah i think it's either the base and the hob and that install or do the cabinets and the drawers make them up and get them installed still considering redoing the cupboards overhead because i don't know if i'm too happy with them at the moment but uh we will see but that is the end of this episode if you did enjoy this episode give us a little thumbs up and if you are new around here hit that subscribe button it's completely free it supports me out massively and it keeps me motivated so i'm excited for when this is going to be finished every time we're getting closer and closer it's taken shape massively and um yeah i'm gonna actually i'm gonna get some more clad in as well so we can finish around the walls and down there um but yeah anyway thanks for watching guys uh, i'll see you in the next episode peace out